Um, it's uh, much less formal, uh, and it's very interactive. So uh, we've locked the doors. <laughs> Thank you now, ladies and gentlemen, to Recycled Meeting. conversation and we're wondering if you might have seen any moments where if someone had done something slightly different we wouldn't have had that outcome so just a quick survey did you have any of those times when you went go oh god or oh or any of that hands up raise your hands if you felt anything at all oh in the back you could put up legs <laughs> yes now quite a few okay well what's going to happen is Ali and I are actually going to um, play with you for the next hour and a half um, to see what we can come up with and what sort of ideas we can generate because this really is a dialogue uh, unlike traditional theatre, right? Um, I am uh, trained as what we call a joker which means I'm not like a facilitator because facile means to make easy and I'm not going to make it easy on you. <laughs> I'm going to ask you to try things. Um, and in the interest of sustainability, Ivy is training tonight, and this is her first night doing it, to do the same thing. So, uh, give her lots of love. Yeah. So, we're, you're going to see us tag teaming and talking to you a lot, so just know that. What we're going to do is we're going to set up from the beginning of the play, and we're going to ask you to just yell stop when you see one of those moments. So, top of recycled meaning. Uh, well, good morning, class. Uh, <coughs> I'm Jeff Patterson, and I'm here to talk to you, your environmental science class, about uh, I, yeah, about what I do. I'm a uh, stop. <laughs> Did you get stop? We, you don't have to do the rest of the play. You just have to try your idea. So that's one of the things you should know. Second thing you should know is um, not everything we do, we call these interventions, not every intervention is going to work, which is really good because human nature, we learn more from our mistakes than we do from our successes. So we want to figure out why things don't work. And the last thing is, please don't hit the actors. <laughs> <laughs> which I know, maybe to you out there, seems like it could never happen, but trust me, violence is an answer because it happens. So if you feel the need to get someone, which could happen, right, you know, um, all I'm going to ask you to do is just raise a hand and freeze or go into a push or a fist, whatever it feels like you need to do, and just freeze. I will be here the whole time, just nice and loud for these folks. Where do you want to go from? Um, where do you first start? Okay, so you can just start talking and you can talk about anything that matters to you. How does that sound? Okay. <laughs> so from the top. Sure. <laughs> so, 
So would you mind just closing the computer for a few minutes? Uh, no, actually, um, I'm like taking my notes, so I'm actually listening to you, but I'm moving that thing. Okay. Well, we'll see how that works, but yeah, it's a little loud. loud. No, it works really well. <laughs> timid, right? Mm -hmm. Even though it was clear that the right thing to do was to show respect. Yeah, absolutely. All right, good job, Chelsea. <laughs> now, <clears throat> it seems a bit of a stretch for us to think that this scene could actually change the very outcome of the play, but do you think that her approach can change his outcome? Yes, why do you think that? Um, because there's confidence in changing a situation that at first seems to be going in the wrong direction. A new confidence. An, a, a new confidence and, and that I